will show you how to play. And I'm giving us a cat because I'm lazy. I love cats. I know you do. I love the sounds. They're really satisfying. They're really cute. I love this game. I have too many favorite things. Do You can do what I did, which is put whatever your hyperfixation of the week is. Um... I'm gonna put banana slugs. What's parsnip? <laughs> Parsnips are a plant. Now come on, we gotta go plant them. I'll show you how to do that. I don't like that I'm standing on them. It makes me sad. Yeah, the Minecraft instinct is don't stand on your plant. Yeah. I really wish I had succulents. I'm gonna start introducing myself to some of the people here because I need to get that close down. You digging through the trash? I didn't. I meant to go in there, but... You can dig through the trash. Hey, don't abandon me. I don't know where to go. Come here. I'm over here, Carla. Where? Down here. The beach is down here. I have a rock. I don't know what it is, though. That's coal, and we will use that later. Take it. There you go. I did. A backpack? Is that like a kinkin backpack? I spent all our money on cauliflower seeds, I'm sorry. I like cauliflower. This guy's name is Pierre? Yes. That's an ugly name, bro. If you come back here, you can meet his wife and daughter. Carolyn. That's a good name. They're Caroline and Abigail. I actually just want to meet your husband. That's very thoughtful of you. God damn it. I didn't mean to give that to you. Whatever. Yeah. I don't know why, but it went out while I was playing Red Dead Redemption. And you're just like... You know? Yeah, and I had just found a really fat stack of money, and I lost it. So, as soon as I gain my motivation back, I'm gonna go back to Fort Mercer and fight... All those gang members again and get my money. Do it. I believe in you. Also, I found a Mexican sombrero and it was really fly and I lost it. Oh no. So I have to go back and look for it because I really want it. It looks dope. You gonna it come looks here really and help funny. me water the plants? What? You're doing things. Yes, I am out foraging because I need my foraging skill up and I'll probably uh, fish a little too. Play this game like I play Animal Crossing. <laughs> I love Animal Crossing. I've only played the app, but I love it. It's so good. Get into yes and play Animal Crossing. It's the most amazing. It's so I don't even know how to describe it. It's so peaceful. Uh, I really. And when will Animal Crossing come out on the Switch? The animals are really cute. That's why I like this. Game. They are. I, I want to switch one... switch just because when Animal Crossing comes out on it, I want to be able to grab it. That's true. It's about the angles. I love angles. Maybe that's why I like geometry so much, because I have a lot of symptoms of OCD. Maybe you're just a giant nerd. Yeah, probably. I don't like that there's so many rocks over here. That makes me sad. What happened? Meteor. Oh, I found a meteor in Red Dead Redemption. Oh, that's cool. Meteors happen in here sometimes, too, but... I got a geode. Oh, dope! That's really cool! Um, if you come to the town, uh, the blacksmith area, I can show you what to do with that. Because you can break that geode open. Like the Pokemon. Why are you breaking Pokemon open? Geo dude. Oh. Well, I mean, you shouldn't break him open either. He's a sweet boy, Carla. If you break him open, there's probably something cool inside. 
I don't know. I've seen a geodude self-destruct before, and I think it's just gravel. That's disappointing. But isn't it really fucked up that Pokemon have a move that's just called self-destruct, where they just fucking blow themselves up? Aren't they supposed to be kind of like animals? Because that's animal cruelty. Yeah, except you don't get to choose when they do that. Like, they do that on their own. Suicidal. I know, it's like, I would literally rather die than be with you. Yep. Okay, well we need to go to bed soon anyway, so sell what you can sell and... I'll be back up in a second. You're sluggish from overexertion. That's called pushing yourself to the limit. It is, and it's not healthy. It's fun sometimes, though. It's not, and you have a lot of unhealthy habits, Carla. We need to talk about this. All my habits are healthy. Having a farm sounds a little bit difficult if it's like a successful farm because people will try to rob you if you live in the wild, wild west. The wild west. Yeah, farms. That's where I'd rob. Absolutely. Yeah, you can just steal all their sheep. I love sheep so much. Sheep are pretty good. They're some of my favorite animals. You can get I sheep in them. this. We should get some because I like the sounds they make. They make some pretty great sounds in those too, but we have to wait a little bit. Hey, Marnie. I guess we're having this conversation. Oh, this is uh, the cat. Oh, you should be cat here. Mixed seed. They're going to the entrance of your farm. I think you might want to start um, watering those things. So while I get through this, of course I'll adopt this cat. Its name is absolutely going to be Miso. I got another Geo. Good. Well, it's good now. now we have a cat. We're really living the lesbian dream. I lose energy from watering plants? Yeah. What kind of extremely weak human being am I? You don't have to water these, you can just grab them. A parsnip? Yes. You've been parsnipped. Am I not supposed to eat parsnip? <laughs> no, you can. <laughs> Until... Oh, I want chickens. I love chickens. Uh, but we're not gonna build one until a little bit later, but it won't be that long. Before. He doesn't have useful information. It's uh, near the museum, it's right above it. Of course, the museum. It's across the river. Where's the river? Fuck Jojo Mart. Um, What's wrong with Jojo Mart? They represent the capitalist hell we came from. That's what they Oh yeah, Elliot is the guy with the long Elliot's the really dramatic writer who lives by the beach. Yep, I talked to him already. He's just standing on the beach. I appreciate him. The person I haven't introduced myself to is Sebastian. How dare he?